This is Taylor from Nuts and Bolts Speed Training with how to save your company's PowerPoint template to your computer and how do you set that up as default, which is smart for two reasons. The first reason is when I'm here in PowerPoint and now I hit Control N for a new blank presentation, instead of getting a blank presentation, instead, when I'm here in PowerPoint and hit Control N for a new blank presentation, instead I get my company's PowerPoint template and all of the slides that they've built for me. On top of that, if you're a heavy Excel user, instead of manually formatting these graphics to meet your company standards, instead, if you save that company template to your computer, you can simply apply that theme to your Excel spreadsheet and be done. So let's start with saving your PowerPoint template to your computer. And the key point here is you want to save it to the default folder that opens. To save your company's PowerPoint template to your computer, you're first gonna open up your company's PowerPoint template. You're then gonna navigate to the design tab open up the themes drop down the line with the arrow and simply select save current theme. This is going to open to the documents theme folder, which is where you do need to save this theme. If you click to your desktop or your documents, this isn't going to work. So if you do lose this window, I'll simply cancel out, simply come back into PowerPoint design tab, themes drop down, save current theme. I'm just going to type template and I'm going to click save. And you'll know you have saved that template to your computer because if you come back to the design tab, and you open up the themes drop down, you should have a custom section with all of the themes you've saved to your computer. But if I hit Control N for a new blank presentation, I don't get that company PowerPoint template quite yet. So let's talk about actually setting a default theme so that new PowerPoint presentations will always start with your company template or whatever company theme you've saved. Once you've saved a company theme or your company template to set it as the default theme, you're simply gonna come and navigate to the design tab. You're gonna again open up the themes drop down. You're gonna come and find that custom theme. If you don't have a custom theme here, you are gonna need to go back to the first step. Here, you're simply gonna right click it and select set as default theme. If I select set as default theme and then hit control N for a new blank presentation, instead of a blank presentation, I get my company's PowerPoint template, which includes all of the slide layouts that they've already pre-built for me. So now that we've saved a PowerPoint theme to our computer, let's look at how we apply it to Microsoft Excel. So yes, your PowerPoint template themes can be applied to your Excel spreadsheets so you don't have to manually format your spreadsheets yourself. Once you've saved a PowerPoint template or a PowerPoint theme to your computer, you can then apply it to your Excel spreadsheets. To do that, simply come up to the page layout, come to themes, you're gonna see the default theme and a, the other themes that you have saved on your computer, which in this case are one and the same thing. So I'm simply gonna apply my company template and I get all my corporate colors applied to my Excel spreadsheet without having to do it manually. As a quick recap of this video, that is how to save a template or a theme to your computer, how to set that template or theme as the default theme that opens for all of your new blank PowerPoint presentations, and then how to apply that PowerPoint template or theme to your Excel spreadsheets so you don't have to manually format them yourself. If you're new to our channel and want to learn more of our PowerPoint hacks, tips, and tricks, what we like to call PowerPoint hack trickery, please subscribe here on YouTube. And if you're just looking for some PowerPoint resources to help get you to happy hour, like PDF cheat sheets and courses, look for the links directly beneath this video. This is Taylor from Nuts and Bolts Speed Training, and I'll see you at happy hour.